well it's a lovely <coughs> summer's afternoon here in Yorkshire and uh, well you're about to go on a little trip I've just got back from Hereford and whilst there I saw some amazing fields full of all sorts of produce being grown here in this country on a massive scale so you're going to go off now and have a tour of Hereford I do apologize in advance for the quality of the sound and some of the pictures I didn't take any equipment with me apart from my old mobile phone we've captured it some's really good some's all right but you'll get the flavor of the Herefordshire countryside and the things they're growing down there I was quite amazed it's funny what you find behind a hedgerow and that's why I'm sat in front of my sweet corn because down there they're growing maize or is it sweet corn that's the question of the week maize or sweet corn because they're both from exactly the same family down here in Herefordshire at one of the country's biggest pick your own and behind me here are tunnels and tunnels acres and acres of strawberries blackberries raspberries incredible incredible acres and acres as you know I like to grow my own but this is on another scale here behind me here are acres and acres of hops fields upon fields of hops when you come later or earlier next year none of this is here the growing frames are here but the hops are cut down and they've all gone and you see empty fields and look at it now full of life and full of hops Herefordshire is quite an amazing place for growing lots of different types of foods well as I said I'm here in Herefordshire and is it amazing you drive past these places all the time when I visit down here and I've never known they've grown sweet corn before or is it maize well they're tall this is what in fact mine are doing this at home I don't know if you can see because the sun's out they're starting to go funny at the top and I panicked I thought they were bolting but look in here down here look there's the sweet corn coming isn't that exciting and uh, of course we're in Herefordshire and uh, oh, Hereford is famous for its brown clay soil but obviously it's very very good soil because well, look at how much it's growing and again acres and acres and Hereford actually is famous for hops and fields upon fields of apples that's right we're in cider country and uh, well amazing what you find behind a hedge and I'm here legally because this is a, a footpath so don't panic I'll not get arrested I'll see you back in Yorkshire very soon and here I am acres and acres this time of lovely scrumptious apples for that all important Herefordshire cider well it's now time to leave my allotment here in Yorkshire with my lovely tomatoes cabbages beetroot <laughs> and of course uh, I found <laughs> another cucumber uh, we're going to go and visit a viewers garden and we're off to Rotherham to see Kate and Dan and the girls and what they've been doing well it's amazing what's coming up isn't it isn't it lovely you've got beautiful courgettes there look at those there they're coming and remember you can eat the flowers too tomatoes glorious and they're like mine nice and yellow or orange yellow in fact <laughs> I've been wondering why my tomatoes have been growing at different speeds well they're different varieties I've got red ones cherry ones yellow ones and of course I have my vintage variety my deep purple ones I can't wait in fact one of them is just about to fruit and change colour isn't it glorious I can't wait to eat those and then of course you're growing chilies which I'm not being very successful at but you seem to be doing very well and your peppers I think too and of course you planted all beautiful new salad you've got your lettuce leaves there and I think I spy some radishes and in the corner I think you've got a few herbs growing too is that coriander well brilliant stuff well done and well done uh, to Dan too I know he's been working hard there and of course the girls 
Well, I hope you've enjoyed your trip to Herefordshire and uh, enjoyed this Sunday show. Of course, yesterday was uh, Yorkshire Day. So from a very proud Yorkshireman on his Yorkshire allotment here, I hope you've had a wonderful week and we'll see you soon on Jeremy's Yorkshire Allotment Adventures. The Sunday Show.